about why Tommy wanted me to watch the cult thing. It's because they were um, farming sheeple um, to cover up drug trafficking. You know, just like the Alrukans were doing, um, just like so many churches are still doing, um, farming sheeple. And um, that's why they don't want to let you in on the mystery, you know, because the mystery is they're dealing drugs. And um, anyway, um, I guess guess my neighbor just sits in a recliner all night smoking meth. And um, of course, he's, he's not really doing that. I'm just a... And, and it's impossible that, you know, it's impossible that his um, undisclosed source of income is drug dealing. It's just not, it's just not possible. It's, it's just so delusional. And um, anyway, that's not what I wanted to say. Um, when I first met a fox cub runner, I had like this big, big rush of um, something that I didn't really understand. But like this need to grab somebody and take them and... Um, you know, take care of them and stuff. Um, but I had okay when we uh, when we are doing this thing where we're having kids separate from ourselves. We don't we don't save any compartments for meeting them. Um, and the reason why is because it becomes a liability to all of us. And. Um, so that was very short-lived feeling, and um, then it sort of was like, you know, why, why am I, wait, why am, why am I taking care of this guy? You know, who is he? That kind of thing. Um, so, and looking in retrospect, I can look back and I can see what kind of, look more pragmatically at what kind of a person he was. Uh, when I encountered him on the beeline, he didn't know who I was. He thought. I think Sherry told him, or, or went around through, that I was claiming to be somebody that he'd met in childhood. And um, so, um, you know, so I'm, you know, I'm, I always take a read on everybody I pass and um, or encounter. And um, so I figured out something of what was going on. Got inside his head a little bit. Figured out that if I you know, just tried anything conversational, he would take the offensive and um, decided just to wall up and pass. And um, so then I saw he'd changed clothes and came around a different way and um, kind of in, a, in a, different, a different posture because he'd quickly figured out that the situation was not as it had been described. So, um, but, you know, I had the same situation sometimes when I encountered my dad, and this is, I think, becoming a family tradition, as, um, especially when we're in ch still in childhood, if we encounter our parents. Um, it, it's a stressful situation. Because we are people who, um, there aren't many needs of a child for people like us. There are some, and we're there for that. But um, most of what a child needs can be done by people who are nothing like us. And, um, you know, and that has its, its side effects. But um, one of those is that we have a better sense of how to relate or how, how we are, even just how much we are different from other people. 